It's got a slight exhaust leak from the header. This is a 1985 Transgo. It's made by Champion. Oh, we still gotta clean it up a little bit. Basically, you got two seats there that go into beds. You got a bathroom here, a separate shower here, stove and everything, full fridge. Now my father had tried to make this into a very good mile per gallon vehicle. It's got full dual exhaust on it. So this has a uh, 350 small block Chevy in it. The 700 R4 transmission that is practically brand new. Uh, my dad had converted it to the overdrive transmission. He also put on the Holley Projection 2D uh, fuel injection kit. Um, electric fans, aluminum intake manifold, Doug Thorley headers, full dual exhaust. Uh, in attempts to get better fuel mileage at 55 miles an hour he gets just over 16 miles per gallon in this um, real world situation just drive around you probably average about 12 it does need some work it has a slight exhaust leak from uh, the head to uh, header uh, needs a new gasket I can't remember if it has a broken stud in there or not um, after putting the transmission, fuel injection, and all that stuff on, you know, it's had maybe a thousand miles at most put on it. Uh, my father had moved out to Arizona, and he just, when he comes back here, he stays in it sometimes, and a couple short trips around town. Um, just put a ton of money into this, you know, all new stainless steel, chrome uh, hubcaps, um, all the stuff on the motor. You know, it's nice fuel injection, you turn the key, it fires right up and, and drives. Did the serpentine belt conversion, um, you know, bigger transmission cooler, all the odds and ends that you would do with something like this. Does need a bit of a cleaning, has some rust and stuff on the doors. But other than that, it is a very good van, it's reliable, it always starts up, always drives. Make an offer.